Hello everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. I appreciate you looking at my work. Here I'm doing a commission for my friend Christine. She's in a band named Christine and the Lost Keys. I'll try to find a link to their YouTube page and put it below. So what I'm doing, I'm doing acrylic paint on canvas paper. We, uh, right now you can see I'm dabbing on the paint. I'm trying to make more of a skin texture. I already did a couple of the pieces on a live on TikTok as well as Facebook. But for now, this is why I'm tapping into the paper, if you could see, and even using my finger a little bit to dab and kind of blend in. I started off with a gray midtone and I decided to work around that. We both came across the idea of a black and white composition with some spot coloring at the end. She wants some bloody tears, but nothing too horrific. It's So this is where we're at right now. I'm only gonna be able to do a portion of the face for a limitation on time, but you can kind of see what I'm doing here. She has a good amount of freckles when she's not wearing um, foundation, and that's actually what we're trying to push across is how bare someone feels when they're going through traumas of any sort and that's actually what we're trying to achieve to give that emotional vibe with this piece um, as you can see I am dabbing but I'm keeping a couple areas around where the gray is coming through that's going to kind of give you the idea of more of the freckle area so I'm kind of getting the highlights around the actual eyeball and now I'm popping in the shadow basically trying to replicate she has a good amount of freckles on her face and I'm trying to replicate that texture without it looking too excuse me blotchy I'm also working on her temple area I'm using just a small brush for most of this because I notice when I use a bigger brush it isn't giving me the skin texture idea that I want so we're gonna work with that for now I'm also going to put a part two to this uploaded shortly it's gonna be a little bit of a longer video which is kind of why I sped them up but yeah I'm just tapping the paint in um, trying to play with I started off with a mid gray and then I'll add some more white to that to give it more of a highlight if I want it darker, I literally take the same gray and add more black and adjust accordingly. You may see me put the brush in um, some water here and there to give it more of a wash. With acrylic paint, you can put it in water and it'll leave a tint on top of the previous layer that seems to work things out. Well, this is going to conclude this video. Thank you for watching.